What's up YouTube, Electric Kicks here, back at it again with another video. Today we got something different. So Fire Red 3s came out today, super excited. I got to hit on the Nike sneakers app, but I was also expecting a hit because it's a pretty big GR, like you should find pairs anywhere. So if you did want them, you should be able to get them. I just went to finish line, picked up my first pair. It's gonna be another nine and a half. It's also gonna be another personal. I have to double up on the classics. And I will say, after getting a quick glance at them, the quality quality looks great. So it's not like the Fire Red 4 is like mass-produced GR and had a whole bunch of issues. I'm actually rocking those shoes on for you right now. But, you know, this shoe, they did deliver. Jordan Brand did deliver. Just looking at the shoe quickly. Quality, quality looks great. And, you know, no glue stains, no paint chipping, none of that looked amazing so super super excited we're gonna head over to champs and pick up the second pair right now all right so I just walked out of champs picked up my pair right here but man let me tell you the first box that they bring out bro super beat up box super beat up box and I will say like I don't know for me I really care about the boxes and I always want to make sure that they're in good condition because I keep all my boxes I like to collect them I feel like it's part of the whole shoe itself so just as nicely as on my hey you have another one that has like a nicer box they went to the back brought a brand new one so yeah you know just keep that in mind depending on who you're talking to in the cashier just be nice be respectful and you're gonna be able to get your nice box so that's what i did you know just ask nicely like hey can i get a, another box i like to get the, the boxes and yeah i got my box so i'm super happy Got my two pairs. Got a pair coming in from sneakers. Have another pair coming in online from finish line. And the pair from DTLR. So I will say resale is not too crazy. Like it's actually pretty bad. It's like pretty much retail, but you know, if you're just trying to like build clientele or just to the homies, like for me, I get sizes for like my friends. They're like, hey, you want need a size? Yeah, I got you. And I'll help them out. But yeah. We're going to go ahead home and go ahead and do a review and an on feet on this shoe. All right, so we made it home. There was a little bit slight change of plan. Me and my brother actually ended up picking up a whole bunch more pairs than I anticipated at first. But I will say these are for sure a personal. The quality on these is actually really, really insane. So just compared to like the Fire Red 4s, like these do not stand a chance in terms of quality control. These are actually really, really good. Like I was talking about earlier. And you know, some people I, I will say like, I can see this as a good investment. Just look at the Fire Red 4s. But the thing is, we just don't know if threes are in right now and not quite sure how it's gonna pan out in the long run. But I do think this is a really good colorway. There was a lot of people in line for these, but these are for sure gonna be a personal. I did double up. I actually have three pairs of nine and a half now. Uh, not quite sure what I'm gonna do with the third one. Probably gonna go off to a friend, but yeah. Now let's go ahead and get into that in-depth review. All right, so we back here at the station, ready to go into that in-depth review on the Fire Red 3. But before we do that, let's go ahead and take a quick look at the box. Now starting with the box, Jumpman on the front, Nike Air branding on the box right here, nine and a half. This is my personal size. And like I said, I do have a couple pairs, uh, one on the way, two already in hand. And I'm gonna double up for sure. Probably gonna give the other pair to a homie. We do have the elephant print on the box as well on the paper. And the super dope thing is it came with this, the Jordan card that actually shows the specs of the shoe and just kind of like the construction of it so that's really dope that's cool to see that cool little feature i just think it makes the box and the experience of opening it up just a little bit more special now let's go ahead and get back into the shoe so boom fire at three now let me tell you like i said earlier the quality is really nice on these we do feature that tumbled leather on the shoe i don't know if you guys can see that if i just kind of like press down on it really really nice quality 
elephant print nice thick cut of elephant print uh, now it is going to be a little lighter compared to the previous fire red models but this is going to be close to the original boom nike air on the back this is what we've been waiting for been waiting years it just looks better i don't know what it is it just looks better on the retros nike air nike branding on the outsole as well now we do have this red going all around except for on the medial side we have a little bit of white on the midsole so these kind of do look like the katrinas really close to them but they're not jump man on the tongue embroidered no quality issues there at all nike air on the insole as well but overall this shoe really really good quality compared to the uh, fire red force blow it out of the water the quality on these is actually super nice and i was super surprised no issues with any of my pairs at all and uh, yeah super excited but let's quickly talk about retail the resale retail that 210 why because you're getting that nike air so it's gonna be a little bit more expensive but i will say it is worth it for that nike air on the back tab i think this looks so much better and the quality on this is actually pretty nice for a Jordan and in terms of resale they're 230 240 honestly locally you can probably find them for like 250 off local resellers 260 you can probably bargain a little bit but if you do want it go and get it now you may be lucky to go to your mall local mall local sneaker shop Foot Locker Champs finish line they might have some pairs sitting depending on your area my area um, there's a lot of resellers a lot of sneaker heads there's a lot of lines for this shoe so they're probably going to be all sold out maybe a couple sizes left here and there maybe a big size 10 and a half 10 but typically it's going to be the display model but yeah I, you know give it a shot check your check your local malls you might find a pair sitting but if you do want them secondary market is probably going to be your best bet because they're really cheap right now so i pick it up actually i'd wait a week until all the online orders come in that's when prices are going to drop even further then pick it up you can probably maybe pick it up at retail price from local resellers because they're going to just want to get rid of the shoes they're like yep it's a break so people are going to start returning shoes at that time and you're also going to be able to pick them up at retail so let's go ahead and do an on feet look of this shoe i'm super super excited to do on feet yeah, let's let's do it